Let's talk about how you can recover your hacked Google or Gmail account without any recovery phone number or without any recovery email address. When someone hack your account, immediately he will change all possible recovery and login method. After that, you don't have access to any of your recovery option. Since let's talk about how to recover it without any recovery method. Before you start, I invite you to watch this video to the very end. After that, you will be able to recover your account without getting any error. As well as you can find all the alternative recovery methods and related links in this video description. Without any further ado, let's jump into our first method. First, I will try to recover your account just using Google company application. If the first method didn't work for us, we will move to recover through it our default web browser. Let's jump into our first method. For the first method, you can use your Gmail application or your YouTube application or your Play Store or Google application. Here, I will use my Gmail application. I believe everyone has this application in their device. So I will open my Gmail application like this. After opening, tap the profile icon in the top right corner. Then you will see all your Google account. Here you have to select add another account option. Just tap it. Then you have to select the very first one, Google. Now just wait a few seconds until it gets checked. After checking, you will get this login interface. Here you have to enter your hacked Gmail ID. If you don't remember that one, you can tap forward email option. After that, they ask you to enter your first name and last name. Finally, they will provide you a Gmail ID. As well as if you send some email to your friend, you can ask help from your friend too. If you remember your hacker Gmail ID, you can enter your ID like this. After entering your Gmail address, tap the next button. Then you will get this welcome window as well as they ask you to enter your password to log into your account. If you don't have your password, hacker already changed it. All you have to do, tap the forgot password button in the bottom left corner. Tap forgot password, then they show you all possible recovery options one after another. Here, I recommend you to select at least one recovery option. Now, if you have turned on two-factor authentication using another application, they ask you to enter that application code here. But unfortunately, if you can't access that application, all you have to do, select try another way. Then they will show you another recovery option. Here, if you have generated some 8 d backup code, you have to enter any of these backup code here. But unfortunately, if you will miss all those keys, you have to tap try another way. Then it will redirect to another recovery option. This one is critically important. Here, they ask you to enter your mobile number as well as you can see the last two digits of your mobile number. If you remember this mobile number as well as if you can access this mobile number, I recommend you to enter that mobile number here. Then they will send a verification SMS. If you open that SMS, you will see there is a one-time verification code. Using that code, they will allow you to reset your password and log into your account. But unfortunately, if you can't access your SIM card, all you have to do, tap try another way option in the bottom left corner. Like this, tap try another way. Now they will list out all your recovery email address. As the first option, you can see this is the email address that I'm going to recover. The secondary email address is your recovery email address. If you have access to this email address, you can get a verification code to this email address. Using that one-time verification code, you can easily reset your password and you can log back into your account. As well as if you already added an alternative email address, it will list out here. You can follow the same strategy. You can get a verification code and recover your account. But unfortunately, if you have no longer access any of these recovery methods, all you have to do, tap try another way to sign in as the last option. Then you will get this error window, couldn't sign you in. Here they ask you to answer many questions as you can. They ask you to select at least one verification method. Then here they ask you to use a device that you used to sign into Google account before. 
either you can use any mobile device or pc or laptop or tablet or any other device that you used to log into a gmail account or google account before at the third option they ask you to use a familiar wi-fi network such as home or work if you got this error don't worry we can fix this error i invite you to watch the error fixing video in the description after watching that video easily you can fix this error and they will allow you to log back into your account they will provide a recovery link or login link using that link you can easily log back into your account and also in this video i will show you a little trick so close all application then go to your device home screen then swipe down to the notification bar again swipe down to get the full view after that you have to switch between networks if you are using mobile network you can switch to familiar wi-fi network if you are using wi-fi network you can switch back to your mobile network like this you can switch between your network this is the first option for the second option you have to turn on your location permission like this i will turn on my location permission after that you have to go back to your device home screen earlier we use our google application instead of using your google application this time i invite you to use your default web browser it doesn't matter which browser on your mobile open your default web browser like this i will open my browser then you have to go to search bar here you have to search this word recover your google account or gmail just select that one then you will get this kind of search result here you have to select the very first search result how to recover your google account or gmail again you will be redirected to this window here you have to scroll down and select recover your google account or gmail under forward to your password just tap this blue color link then you will be redirected to this window now google has mentioned they have upgraded their recovery window they have mentioned that in the message here you can dismiss this message after that you have to enter your hacked gmail id if you forgot that you can select forgot email then you can provide first name and last name and your phone number then they will provide you your hacked gmail id like this i will enter my gmail id then i will tap the next button then they ask you to enter your password here you can try out any old password that you use log into your google account but if you don't remember any of these password all you have to do tap forgot password option then it will show you all possible recovery option one after another here if you have turned on two factor authentication using another application they ask you to enter that code here but if you can't access that application right now you have to tap try another way as well as if you have generated some backup code google asks you to enter it here if you don't remember any of these tap try another way as well as this one is little bit important if you already add some recovery email address or if you turn on two factor authentication using your mobile number they ask you to enter your mobile number first after entering your mobile number they will send a verification code via sms using that verification code they will allow you to recover your google account and reset your password here i highly recommend you to select this option but unfortunately if you can't access this phone number you can request a new sim card to the same number from your telecommunication partner after that you can easily reset your password but unfortunately if you can't get that number or if you can't access your sim card all you have to do tap try another way in the bottom right corner then it will show you all recovery email address the first one is my current email address which one is hacking that i'm going to recover the second email address is your recovery email address this one is important you can request a one time recovery code using that recovery code you can reset your password and recover your account but unfortunately if you don't have access to any of these recovery email address or any other recovery method all you have to do tap try another way to sign in at the bottom then you will get this window then google have been confirmed this phone really belongs to me as well as they have verified i'm the real owner of this gmail id or google account 
so they will allow me to log back into my account as well as they will allow me to recover my gmail or google password but unfortunately if you didn't get this welcome back message and they don't confirm this account really belongs to you is still you getting that error message call couldn't sign you in you have to watch the full error fixing video in that video i have mentioned different ways to fix this error and log back into account so those you got this error message again i highly recommend you to check the video link in the description or you can click this card icon in the top right corner of this video after watching that video easily you can fix that error and also you can log back into an account like this you will get this welcome back message and they will allow you to change your password without having your old password here i highly recommend you to update your google password because hacker already knows your gmail password so you have to convert into new one so you have to create a new strong password for the new password you can include some characters special cases and capital letters and numbers like this you have to create a unique password not a common one you have to enter your new password twice after entering new password twice you have to tap the save password button then this will be your new google or gmail login password using this password easily you can log back into a hacker account after saving password you will bring to this security checkup window here i'm not going to show you how to increase the security level of your account otherwise this video will be longer so i will upload another tutorial how to show you increase the security level of your gmail or google account you can find that video link in this video description i hope you will watch that video too after going through this security checkup you have to tap continue to gmail at the bottom finally you will be logged into your hacked gmail account this is just a one way to recover your account if you want to learn alternative methods or if you get any error while recovering your account i invite you to watch the error fixing videos and alternative methods video links in this video description or you can click this end screen videos and come on over this is the end of the today's tutorial see you in the next one later